Ashley Vox here, and uh, we're just going to be talking about the new feature, or my new feature, and then talking about, first topic will be Darius Geis, Darius Geis' torn ACL. So, Darius Geis, as you guys know, is probably perhaps one of the best running backs in this year's draft class, and in week one of his first ever professional game as a running back, he tore his ACL. And I think this makes the Redskins running uh, running chart sink a little bit, even though they have Adrian Peterson as a replacement. But his age is just making him decrease, and uh, I don't think they'll be as good as everyone expected. So, yeah. And that's my opinion. We're going to be talking about my home team and my favorite team, the Seattle Seahawks. So, I'm talking about their offensive line. Uh, as everyone knows, the last few years, ever since Super Bowl 49, they have been absolute trash. And this year, they finally they fired the whole coaching staff, pretty much. New offense, uh, or new offensive line coach. And so, last week, they were, or they were up against the Minnesota Vikings, which is the top-rated defensive line last year. And in the two and a half quarters they didn't play, they played, uh, they didn't allow a sack, and Russell Wilson even quoted in an interview that he had all day and felt no pressure, and Chris Carson actually did really good, so I think the Seahawks offensive line is improving. It's still got a little work to do, but they'll get better as the season goes. <laughs> Gotta take Teddy Bridgewater traded from the New York Jets to the New Orleans Saints for a third round pick. And um, personally, this kid can't catch a break. Teddy Bridgewater, he, so a couple years ago, I think it was an injury that caught him out a few years and with the Vikings. Then he gets traded to the New York Jets, only plays about three or four games, and then terrific preseason. Not every competing for the starting spot, then all of a sudden traded to the New Orleans Saints. So I think Drew Brees will be his mentor until he retires, and then Teddy Bridgewater will take over a new era in New Orleans. Uh, but on in the New York side, Sam Darnold uh, expected to be the Week One starter. I think that was announced, and I think the Jets. This might be the last year that they are not really a good team. They might not make the playoffs this year, but in the future, I think they'll be a very good team. So, there. That's my opinion.